In this video, I will guide you how you can activate Vodafone eSIM. So first of all, you need to make sure to visit their application or onto their website. You need to simply purchase the package that you want to go with. In this case, let's go with this as an example. And you need to simply enter all of your personal information and your card details and make sure to complete the purchase. Now, once you have completed the purchase, you will gonna receive a QR code onto your email address or into the mobile application, which you can scan the QR code for. Otherwise, click on settings and then you need to head over to mobile or cellular and then you need to simply click on add eSIM. This is how it is going to look like. So click on add eSIM and now you need to simply click on use QR code in order to scan the QR code which you have received onto your email address or into your mobile application. Now once you have scanned the QR code it is now going to ask you to activate your eSIM so simply click on continue and then wait for a few minutes in order for the eSIM to be completely activated on your device. After you have activated your eSIM it's now time to add your cellular plan labels. It is going to be selected, let's say secondary, you can also change it accordingly or you can add your own personal label. Otherwise click on continue and now you need to choose the default line which is going to be primary and then again tap on continue. As for the iMessages and your FaceTime, you can again select the primary and click on continue. For the cellular data which is the last step, make sure that it is selected to secondary or and is the name that you have selected during the label process and also double check that allow cellular data switching is toggle off then click on done button once you are done you can now simply head over to the cellular data and make sure that data roaming is toggle on so that's the way of how you can activate vodafone eSIM